Hey YouTube, it's Chris, and welcome back to the YouTube journey. Uh, today, um, I was actually talking to Steven, I guess a few days ago while we were editing the past two videos, I guess, somewhere in between the two of those. And um, somewhere in the conversations that had been going on for those between those two videos, um, a conversation came up. It was early in the morning, and I had just woken up, and Steven and I were talking, like we usually do throughout the day, and, um, something came up, and it was pretty big to me. Um, and that's a little bit of an ongoing debate that I think is extremely important to the world, and that is that Steven thinks that pancakes are better than waffles. I know, you're obviously very upset because waffles are 20 times better than pancakes in every single way. Now my roommate just gave me a dirty look, <laughs> but <laughs> I'm just going to say that, <laughs> oh my goodness. So. It's obviously a very, very high-strung debate that between waffles and pancakes. So I thought that today for the video that we would just have a little bit of a talk um, and me and Steven would give our sides of the argument as to why um, we think one is better than the other. So um, I'm going to give Steven the floor first. I don't know what any of his points are going to be. And I want him to just argue his points with seeing mine already. And I feel that even with that advantage that I'll still win because waffles are truly better than pancakes in every single way. And I do mean that. Now. Honestly, I don't even think I have to say a word. There's literally nothing for me to defend about pancakes. People who eat waffles are the ones who have explaining to do. Just look at the kind of irresponsible behavior that a lot of waffle eaters have. Like they just pour syrup on because they think that they have to use all these little square pockets. And the amount of syrup that they put on and can consume in a single waffle is part of the reason why waffle eaters have a significantly higher risk for contracting diabetes. Like, why would you eat a food that is a hazard to your health? When you could just have pancakes, which promote way better habits, and don't require a knife to eat. Seriously, there's no way for you to text somebody if you're too busy holding a knife in your other hand to eat this terrible, inefficient food. Hello, internet? Yes. You can confirm that waffles are better than pancakes? Well, the internet says so. What was that? The internet also says that, um, waffles are better. And this, the internet agrees with me and so does this banana. And I just pulled up straw poll to, to see what the internet had to say. And the internet says that 57% of people prefer waffles over pancakes. Well, to that I have to say, the internet also has furries. Chew on that. Another problem with waffles. It's ridiculously difficult to try and spread anything over. For instance, the other day, just to, you know, experiment, give waffles a fair chance before I went on and trash talked them, I grabbed a waffle for breakfast. I think it was breakfast. Brunch. Whatever you want to call it. And I'm going to play the footage back for you and you just watch how terrible it is to try and spread peanut butter on a waffle. Like, you can't just go straight across the surface like you would a pancake. No. You gotta take your knife, you know, the knife that you have to have because you're eating a waffle, and you have to like go inside all the little pockets and spread it around because if you don't, it's just going to get stuck all in one spot. Why? Why would you design something that way? Why would you have it be so terrible? Pancakes represent the way food is supposed to be made, you know? You just take some batter, throw it on a stove, and bam, pancakes are done. None of this nonsense you have with waffles where, no, you can't just, you know, make a waffle. You gotta have a special waffle iron and make all these stupid little squares. Like, what? Why? Why would you want to make food like that? You don't. Take it on a camping trip. Take it on a pirate ship. I don't even care. You can make pancakes literally anywhere you have a heat source. 
With waffles, no, you have to have this fancy waffle iron because you gotta make all the little squares. Haha, -ha. no, no, that is not how we eat food. That is just not how food is meant to work. And I'm gonna let you all in in a little secret. I know Chris doesn't like pancakes. I'm pretty sure I know the reason why, too. You can go to the store, buy these little things of frozen waffles. They take absolutely no skill to cook, you just throw them in the toaster, and bam, you have waffles cooked. Now, when it comes to food that takes actually some sort of skill, some level of knowledge and capability, and ability to use a stove... Can't do it. He just can't. And that's why he doesn't like pancakes, because he's never tasted a good pancake. Because he can't make them. And I suspect this applies to a lot of waffle lovers out there. Y'all are just too inept at being able to cook that you have to resort to a food that takes absolutely no skill to make. And finally, I'm going to address the fact that yes, Chris did give me an advantage by letting me see his arguments first. But I didn't need it, because you know why? I looked through the footage, and he literally said nothing except, Waffles are great. Waffles are great. I don't know, guys. Waffles are good. Don't you like me? I, my name is on this channel. You have to agree with me. Don't listen to the other person, because waffles are good. Oh my gosh, waffles. I don't know. Look at this footage. Don't you see how fake and overacted his reactions are? He's addressing the camera directly, making sure to smile and swing back and forth. There's no reason for that. The only explanation is that he's so far brainwashed that even if he knows deep down that he doesn't enjoy these waffles, he still has to pretend to like them anyway in order to advance the cause. And you know what? Quite frankly, I don't even care if I win. You know why I don't care? Because it's you people who eat waffles that have to suffer the consequences of your decisions. So go ahead, suffer through your meals because you decided that instead of picking pancakes, no, you had to go with the inferior food. You know, and after you're done eating that trash, you can come back to me and tell me if you think it was really worth it, because I guarantee it was not. But it's whatever. I honestly can't save you guys if you're that far gone. All I can do is... Hope. Hope that someday you'll see the light. Um... So now that Steven has given his argument, I guess, it is my turn. So... First off, um, waffles just taste better, okay? Uh, pancakes are too doughy usually. They always taste kind of weird. They're heavier. I don't like that feeling you get after you eat a bunch of pancakes that it sits in your stomach like a rock, and I don't like that. But waffles are a different story. Waffles not only taste better, you can eat waffles plain and they're delicious, but they're amazing. And another thing about waffles is they have these little like like geometric shapes in them that are perfect for holding the syrup in and you get a perfect amount of syrup in every single bite as long as you cut it along those little geometric square things and if you don't then I don't know what you're doing you're not eating waffles the right way what's wrong with you but also um there's so many other things you can do with waffles like you can put peanut butter on waffles and of course Steven and I love peanut butter Ow, I hit myself in the face with this. <laughs> peanut butter, how could you do this to me? But peanut butter is amazing, and I eat it right out of the thing usually, but peanut butter on a waffle is even better. You can take this yummy peanut butter, you could throw it away, and you could get something way better, or you could take the yummy peanut butter and put it on a waffle, which is way better. Way better. Waffles are amazing, okay? And also, the thing about waffles, is, um, they're just better, okay? Everything's better when it's waffle. You could take, like, cinnamon bun stuff and put it in a waffle maker and make a cinnamon bun waffle. You could take meat, like ground chopped meat, and put it in a waffle maker and make a meat waffle. I guess. Maybe don't do that. Actually, don't do that. Please don't do that. But still, um, waffles are better. Waffles are way better. I don't know, guys. I think waffles are better. But, I guess this is our fan engagement for this video, and maybe, like, we'll get lots of comments on the next video. But I think that in order to try to get you guys to interact with us a little more in the comments and stuff, uh, we're going to have the debate continue there. So you guys can gladly... Uh, 
join the fun of this waffles versus pancakes debate. And, um, I mean, they just, waffles are better, guys. You know the right, the correct side of this war, and you know the incorrect side of this war. And you know that waffles are better. You know deep down, right here, in your, like, heart and probably your gallbladder and stuff, that waffles are better. You know it. So don't lie to yourself anymore and accept it. <laughs> I don't know if this is the most serious video we've made on the channel or the stupidest video we've made so far on the channel. Honestly, it could go either way. But, um, I guess that's it for the video today. <laughs> Um, <laughs> thank you so much for watching. This has been Starinari, but you can call me Chris. And thank you so much for watching, guys. And I'll see you all next time. This has been Starinari, but you can call me Chris. Signing off.